hey, just doing a quick video over uh, how I got my setup down here in the bar for doing uh, meetings or uh, any sort of uh, uh, Zoom meetings or interviews or want to film any sort of like cocktail making. I'm um, using my own condenser mics versus the onboard mic on my iPad. Um, as you see here, I got a uh, mic set up around the place. Got my condenser mic over there. Uh, iPad on a tripod. Um, got a uh, separate um, Kindle Fire over here uh, playing music from the background. So I'll get through that here in a second. Um, in order to set this all up, basically you need to start with the camera um, adapter for your iPad. So it's lightning port to USB and there's an additional lightning port on it for being able to charge. Um, so now I'm going to walk around the bar do, 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 do. on this side. Okay, so you got the adapter there set up which goes into what I had found out that I needed to do is I needed a power supply for this USB sound card. Um, so basically what you're doing is you're running your sound card into this powered um, data USB hub um, that feeds your mic and everything. Um, your ingoing mic and sound going into the on the built-in USB port plug that goes into your adapter. Then you also have your there's a designated charging port at the bottom of this that allows you to charge your iPad while you're recording and doing video. Um, so when doing the doing the um, external mics you need to find you can do um, sorry about the floppy uh, flopping around at the camera um, so basically you got your there's a mic in port and then there's an audio uh, headphone port on this uh, sound card um, so basically you need to run your audio your through the mic coming off my soundboard, which is just a, a Mackie uh, eight channel um, that I bought off of Amazon a while back. I was using it for uh, recording podcasts or whatever. So basically what that's doing is you're running your, off your main out, you're running that through to your, uh, your soundboard or your, your USB uh, sound card microphone. Um, I got over here on a designated channel here for um, the Kindle Fire that's playing the music in the background. Um, that basically just runs all the way straight over into the Kindle Fire. So that's bringing the audio from the fire Kindle over here to this where I can control, you know, um, the levels and stuff. So I got it set for a nice quiet background music for right now. Uh, then, you know, obviously you got your two microphone cables here for your uh, condenser mics. Um, so basically what this is doing is you got the audio going into your microphone and then I've got the audio coming back off of the uh, iPad using the, US, uh, the headphone jack on the USB sound card. That's running back into a two channel or a, a audio video switch that I had laying around. Um, so basically that's running into that. Then I've got uh, it, that switch running into my um, receiver over here. So basically I can hear the audio coming through my bookshelf. Uh, KLH um, speakers up there on the top shelf. Um, the way I've got it set up right now, I'm not getting any sort of feedback uh, off of uh, the audio coming off of those speakers. The one thing, you, my one thing I can't figure out is to get the audio to actually play the microphone audio, I guess, to come through um, so I could hear that over the speakers, but that's not really all that important. Uh, that's why you got headphones and you, you know, 
uh, do a test run and figure out your settings with your volume levels. Um, but basically that's it. Um, I'm allowed to do, I can do Zoom meetings now and have uh, have um, actual music playing in the background throughout the duration of the time. Um, and then also I'm able to actually hear as people speaking off the speakers that are behind the bar. Um, and it's not really being picked up on the condenser mics. So that's basically it. Um, again, I just wanted to figure out a way to where I can actually do a little bit more professional audio uh, with um, using my, my own condenser mics and also being able to play background music for doing like um, uh, any sort of uh, uh, Zoom meetings or any sort of video recording um, calls or anything like that. So I, I want to interview somebody down here or have a guest bartender down here we can actually do some good recording down here and that's about it i'll uh share links um to the pieces that i bought off of amazon and, and like i said you guys can figure it out yourself after that uh but so far i'm very very pleased with how this setup's working for me thanks